This morning, we are highlighting one of the ways government leaders hope to lift the economy out of the COVID-19 pandemic. The program is called New Market Tax Credits. Leaders say it's worked in the past. President Bill Clinton actually created this program in 2000. T President Bush leaned on it after Hurricane Katrina. It's been multiple presidents done that. President Obama used it to get through the Great Recession during his term in office. And right before he left office, President Trump also extended the program, giving the largest extension in history. KSHB 41 News reporter Charlie Keegan shows us the real-life impact of the program. Five to six days a week. The YMCA is Steve Shipman's sanctuary. This completely changed my life. In 2015, doctors diagnosed him with cancer. At about the same time, the Atchison YMCA used new market tax credits to pay for renovations to its downtown community center. It added a second floor and renovated the entire facility. I had to take the elevator to the second floor. I couldn't walk up the steps. Shipman's now cancer free and working out several hours a day. This is my main staple. I mean, this is what I have to have right now. A lot of people credit the new YMCA for leading to more growth in downtown. But the impact of new market tax credits doesn't just stop here in Atchison. In Westport, PlexPod used this program to transform the old Westport Middle School into a co-working space. There's a great legacy in this building. Enterprise Bank and Trust is one of the only local groups currently handling the program around around Kansas City. KCPT partnered with the bank to use these credits in an expansion project happening now. It's fun to be a part of the development of our community. Adam Kilpatrick says the goal is to give developers more incentive to build in underserved areas. The shaded parts of this map on KCMO's east side and throughout KCK show neighborhoods eligible for the program. We really do want to use these for the benefit of our community as a whole. The big payoff is jobs. Since 2013, projects Enterprise has helped with the process have created more than 600 permanent jobs. Jobs like staff members at the YMCA who keep shipment active. The facility is fantastic, so can't override that. But uh, without the people, you don't have much. Without people, you don't have much. Charlie Keegan, KSHB 41 News.